I really like that challenge. I think the dish that you set was beautiful, it was classic, and three or four basic techniques that if they didn't get right, they're gonna show absolutely in the final dish. And I've got no idea how they're gonna go, to be honest. Let's get the first dish in. I'm really proud of my dish today. I've learned how to butcher a lamb, turn an artichoke, and make a beautiful Marco Pierre white sauce. So whatever happens now, this is a day I will never forget. Hello, John. Look at that. John, I was an emotional cooker. I was. I've come into the Master Chef and I've sacrificed quite a lot. I've left a job that I love. My partner, who's living overseas, and um, my family that I truly love. And um, right now, I'm, I'm having the most amazing time in my life, and that's cooking. You don't want that to end up? No. But if I do work hard, I've had a day as an apprentice under Marco, and that's like one in a billion, and I could never ask for more. I don't think you like working to recipes. I think you're more spontaneous. It's all about natural feel. I think you have a lot of natural ability. I think you have something very special. What you must take out of today's challenge is you achieve more by doing less. My fingers are crossed. They really are, because I hope you've done enough today to stay in this competition. John, thank you. More we'll taste. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. Pleasure. How, how, do, how good does that look? Yeah, straight up, that looks absolutely beautiful. I'm really impressed. Can't wait to taste. Nicely prepared, Liam. Look at that. He's done a very good job. Yeah, smashing. It was nice watching him cook. And those artichokes, really white and wonderfully prepared. Absolutely spot on. Perfectly caramelised either side. Lovely balance in the mushrooms, in the garlic. And those artichokes, absolutely pure white, which is great to see. Really good. Brilliant technique. All four, you might say, exactly the same shape and size, all cooked absolutely perfectly. A beautiful representation. I think John's done an amazing job. You know, when you're filled with emotion, it's very easy to become confused. And I don't believe what I saw yesterday. He showed off who he is. Yeah. I think today he has cooked to perfection. Yeah. Great start, great tasting so far. Let's get the next dish in. I'm so frustrated. I've left the skin layer on the noisettes. So I'm hoping that the things I did right today overshadow the things I know that are wrong in that dish. mistake, don't you? I do. As you can see, you've got to take your fat off. Yeah. When did you realise? Uh, after it was too late. <laughs> after time, yeah. You also forgot to tie it. I did. One of them just burst. Yes. Pressure's an amazing thing, isn't it? Yeah. But having said that, I think to achieve what you achieved in that time frame was amazing. Thank you. How has this cook tightened your desire to stay in the competition? 
this shows me that I, I can cook <laughs> and I love to cook and if I can do that today, uh, I want more. I want to do more, more, more. I want to stay. Oh, now it comes down to us tasting it. Yep. Fingers crossed, Jackie. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Well done. Thanks very much. It sounded a bit crunchy, didn't it? A bit under. She certainly had a bit of trouble. Well, I think Jackie's done a really good job. My, my pizza of lamb was a lovely, tight drum. And I love this, just a little bit of garlic through those mushrooms, which really brings the lamb to life. I think lamb loves garlic like sharks love blood. It's a great combination. <laughs> the lightness of the sauce, full-bodied. You can taste the roasting of the lamb bones through it. Yeah, I mean, the, only, the, the, the big mistake here is, is the lamb yeah. fat, obviously. That was uh, in the recipe to remove that. But the lamb's cooked perfectly. Um, and the dish in its entirety is seasoned beautifully. Yeah, although most artichokes are just a little bit on the crunchy side. But let's get the next dish in. I'm really happy with most elements of my dish, but it all comes down to how the others have performed and how I've performed in comparison to them. Of course, I really want to stay in the competition. I love cooking. It's a passion and a dream of mine to pursue that. Andrew, what are you concerned about? Firstly, the lamb, and then just I didn't get my mushrooms onto the meat, which is just frustrating. Sat pains one week, Marco Pierre White the next. <laughs> you're 18 years old. <laughs> Do you see yourself following a career in a professional kitchen? I would love to. I would love to own my own restaurant. That's my dream. If you do go home today, what would be the next step for you to achieve that goal? I would start from the bottom, as most of you did, and work my way up and earn the right to own my own restaurant. Andrea, it was amazing watching you today. Your tenacity, one thing which is very obvious, you punch way above your weight. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Good luck. Whatever the outcome, we're very proud of you at your age. I wouldn't have even dreamt to be able to put up a dish yeah, like that. Yeah, I could There's no way. So you should be very proud. Now it's time for us to taste. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Thanks, Andrew. Thank you. Well, obviously, she has put the mushrooms on top of the lamb. One artichoke's bigger than the other, but they're little things here. I think she's done a, a pretty good job. Yeah. Good and tight, huh? It's a lovely cup. Yeah, good ones, right? Yeah, yeah, they are. Oh. Mine's slightly under. Look. Look at that. Yours is more under the mine. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. How's yours, mate? Under. You know what it is? It's all different. Look at mine. Yours is under. The mine's beautifully cooked. I'm the only lucky one in the line. I know. You're yeah. enjoying it, aren't you? Yeah. The lamb is inconsistent in the cooking. Perfect under, lack seasoning. But you know something? I'm nitpicking. Can I just say, her little noisettes, absolutely smashing. You know, she didn't forget to uh, take the fat off. They're all exactly the same size, um, and she caramelised them well. For me, I really like that sauce. It, yeah. It's light, it's got, it's got, it's got good flavour, it's got good complexity. 
This is a close one race, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Absolutely. Shall we get them in, have a chat? Yes. Yeah. 